Well, many businesses, shopping malls are closing down simply because malls are losing popularity. This includes Vietnamese Women's Cafe at the Morohei Mall in Des Moines. But as our Local 5's Connor O'Neill shares with us, the community might have saved her business. Brenda Tran's Vietnam Cafe has been open for over a decade here at the Merle Hay Mall. But the mall, it's not as busy as it used to be over a decade ago. Luckily for her on Friday, she got some help financially from the community. The buffet last Friday was the best one in my 12-year career at a cook. Seriously. It, it was the best. I and that's because hundreds of Iowans came down to Brenda Tran's Vietnam Cafe to support her business. But the Vietnam Cafe has been living on the edge financially recently. Oh. Um, it's really hard. Brenda opened her business at the mall back in 2010, but it wasn't as easy as you think. Every year I still work 12 to 14 hours a day, seven days a week. Then the pandemic hit. Everyone closed, but I, I can't because I, if I do that, I won't be able to uh, pay all the expenses here and my children at home for go to Catholic school. Brenda's expenses, including having to pay back her $100,000 loan and $10,000 she owed the mall. So Brenda set up a GoFundMe page with a $15,000 goal to keep her business open and hosted that buffet Friday where hundreds showed up to eat. I can't believe that how much love people give it to me. Plus, she hit her goal. And on top of all the difficulties Brenda has had to overcome, she also had to go through immigrating to the United States with her family as a child. I came from uh, Vietnam in uh, 1986. My father uh, left Vietnam when the war was over in uh, uh, 1974, which is a month before the war was over. So. Brenda said her father left the rest of their family behind, but she came to the U.S. two years later. Now with a husband and kids 37 years after immigrating here, Brenda says she is living her American dream with her business. I don't want to give up my dream. When I start my something, I want to continue to uh, fulfill my dream. And that dream is staying open as long as possible at the Merle Hay Mall. The only way I, I feel like I can be survived is turn to my lovely customer. And I can't believe it. Spicy noodle soup. Connor O'Neill. Identified. Local 5 News, we are Iowa.